Anyway, it's time to go fight our villain, Fantoon, who makes an appearance in the trailer for him. Oh, snap. I don't know why I brought that up. I felt like it. Maybe it's like Fontoon Queen or something, because this is a little bit too small to be the real the Fontoon that's in friggin' in charge of a rem. Can't be. Looks like you want to be really touchy today, don't you? I'll still be keeping an eye out on my HP because. What hit me? Anyway, um, what was I was mentioning something, come on. Gotta snap my fingers trying to remember. Ah, yeah, screw it. I'll just talk about Rim because I brought it up when I mentioned Fountain. Just quickly, how do you make it so he opens his eyes quickly? Is it random? Because if it's random, then... Oh, okay, sometimes I got lucky then. But then, yeah, sometimes he just stands there and just doesn't. Sometimes it takes him a minute, and I don't know what the activation is. Maybe it's just letting go of all the buttons? No, that'd be stupid. Maybe. Maybe you have to be standing in the starting place? Anyway, we're talking about Metroid over and in. A game that most people don't like. I like it myself. Ooh, yeah, call me di Call me... something, I don't know. I can see why people didn't like it, because of the whole, um... Like, oh man, you have to reactivate your items, oh my god, it's like they're in a lock. And yeah, that, that annoyed me, and the fact that they did that in the warm area, and blah blah blah, yeah, we all know that scenario. Um, it just, it doesn't bug me. Think of it this way, um, think of him unlocking the items as, like, finding an iron room or something. Like, get to the top of that volcano, you find the various suit, and then you fight the boss. Think of it that way. That'd be cool, right? That'd be kind of intuitive. I guess the fact that they did that is because you're on a space station, and this isn't Metroid Fusion where you're in a new suit and you're trying to find life bombs. You're still in your, you're still in your normal dandy hose and power suit. Well, there you suit or whatever. You're not in any in advanced suit, so it'd be kind of hard to place Chozo artifacts around. And I guess that's why they did it. I know they could have probably come up with a new way of doing it, but again, it makes sense to me. Also, this video is kind of 15 minutes, so you'll probably hear me rambling, and then I'll cut off. Maybe I can do some creative editing. Yeah, I can probably do some creative editing. A minute of creative editing. I don't know, hopefully I can just get this done. Maybe I should have taken time and consideration. Maybe I'll just cut the Sally. You never know. Yeah, I'll cut the Sally and then... Make this a shorter episode, maybe? Shrugs. Alright, anyway, Phantom's dead! Yay! First issue of a Let's Play. I ignore the timer for one of them. <laughs> Oh uh, no. It's strange to think that I'm using this time to like make sure I'm doing this faster than my other things. I, I just, again, I don't really care. In that sense. I guess seems so this will be technically a new episode. Two minutes or so in, maybe. Probably three. I don't know how many minutes I am in. Hi, welcome to the episode. Wait, no, I already just... I'm gonna keep this pin, because this is kind of funny to me, that I'm discussing this. 
Again, this is one of my rambly let's plays. Probably happen a lot more often because I'm, I'm very much rambler. This is this room. It's the first appearance of these little gas bubble guys um, from that one game. Are you sure? God, easy. I forgot about that. Anyway, and you guys who misses. Super great. Um, so we're gonna get a lot of items. You know, probably, probably try and get the, the gravity suit before the end of this episode. Maybe when I pick it up, it will be the end of the episode, and it'll maybe be a short episode so I can get my clock sorted out, my timer. So I don't know how long this is gonna be, or how long I've been recording, or whatever. I just want to make sure I get this all right. Just as long as it's under 30 minutes, I'm fine. So, I might stop at like 25 or something, if I get the... It's like, again, as soon as I get the gravity suit, call it video. This will be the video where I talk about time. Timing in my video. You know what I did when I did Mega Man? I just... I know, like, you, you've seen it, so you probably know, I just recorded a stage and the video. And then, I did that for like four stages a day. I'm not, I'm not doing that for this, as I've probably mentioned, I'm doing it all one day. So, yeah, you might get hypocritical and be like, oh no, but what if someone tells you you missed something? It's like, again, it's one of them let's plays where I'm like, boom, this out of like, is a one off kind of thing, like, has a little bit of time, gives me something to upload. People may or may, li may not like it because if it's rambly, such style. But man, it's so fun. I'm gonna enjoy myself, so. I don't know, you get to see into the mind of a novel. <laughs> it's novel. <laughs> uh, not novel at all. Get to see into my mind. If you have a cad, too. I highly doubt anyone does, but eh, there's people out there who may, who may or may not want to see into thy mind. I don't see, I put, how did I do that? That was like, it was a super short running speed. I also thought it kind of cool. Most of this room, these stupid things, I hate these guys so much. They shoot at me as well, that's annoying. Like, they're in my way and they have the audacity to shoot me. Um. Yeah, that's all I've talked about so far is just saying statements in my videos. And. Huh, I guess I could talk about something. I don't know, I'll probably cover a lot of subjects as I go on in this. <laughs> Oh, Lottie, this is this is gonna be such a thing to watch. I might I might just sit down and watch this at one point. Be like, yep, I did that. That was pretty stupid. You know, I don't need the um the ice beam on at the moment. Just remembered, I could just switch to wave beam. I'd be calling these guys one shot faster, I think. So I think when you freeze them, that is technically them being dead. In terms of game, game subject, like they're being petrified, quote unquote. Unless it's one of the unkillable enemies. But like, you know, if you shot a frozen enemy, they die. I guess that'd be kind of normal. <laughs> What am I talking about? Just let me get my mind back on track. I was talking about something. Oh yeah, freezing. Um, yeah. Uh, this is what I mean, I'm really forgetful. So yeah, freezing effect, um, like that probably would have died, but then I'm frozen last to hit longer. So I guess if I was going for like super speed over to turn it off as soon as like even before I beat Phantom. Maybe. Cause if you fire if you do a um a charged wave beam shot it does a bit more damage than a charged freeze shot, I think. Or was that maybe the other way around? 
He charged three shot does a lot more than a wave one. Anyway, anyway, it's this room. Gotta do a bunch of jumps in it. Yay! Ooh, two. That was that was sweet. That was fast. Anyway, it's this room, like most boring room in the game, according to everyone. And I, and I can't really blame you. I mean, look at what it is. It's just walking. Walk, 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 walk. Step, 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 step. One, two, three, four. I'm trying to think of a nice place to do this. Hmm. I'm, I feel like rambling about worms I'm getting. I picked this up lately. I guess I can thank Pinky Rose for putting up videos for that game because because beforehand I had only played Worms Open Warfare 2 for the DS and then like oh man it's a Worms game I like Worms they do it super hilariously and it's like cool awesome and it's Worms Armageddon which to them and to me is like the best one Thanks to and Worms Up, Worms Up and Warfare 2 is also a pretty frickin' good game. I will not deny that. I love that. Wait, what? What happened that? Okay, I got that point, but what happened before? I just suddenly stopped. Oh well. Anyway, here we're gonna get an, an, a, uh, another friggin' reserve tank. There'll be three out of the fall, but I'm not gonna pick up the fourth one because it's out the way. It's such a thing, I hate doing that kind of stuff. This sounds so bad, doesn't it? Oh god, I hate going out the way for things. Ugh. It's such an out the way thing. I'm doing such a weird loop around. I don't, I don't feel like doing it. Anyway, it's been almost 25 minutes of me recording in this segment. So, I'm going to cut the video in here and restart my timer. So, until next time everyone, this has been Clan and Alley, here with his Let's Play of Super Metroid. Until next time, um, have a good day everyone.